hey y'all welcome back to my channel it's your girl kayla i'm back with another video if you haven't seen my last upload go check that out and you'll see how i achieved this hairstyle so what i'm gonna be doing is my makeup because in that video i'm going to be getting reactions of all my family to my new haircut so let's get into this video i'm not gonna talk too long i'm probably just gonna do some eyebrows i'm gonna put on these lashes they sent them to me for a wig promo so I'm gonna use these lashes. I haven't used them yet. So we're gonna see how they look. I always use Kiss with Aloe. And then I'm going to go ahead and clean off my face with some NYX and go there. I'm gonna call my, my people after I'm done, but I'm not gonna rant too much. We're just gonna get to the video. I guess this could be like a little FaceTime call with y'all. And I could talk cause it's been a little minute. Look what I just did. I just messed up my hair already. Hold on, here we go. I'm blind, but I ain't that blind. Okay, so y'all, where the heck has have, have I been? <laughs> I've been working so much, y'all. Like, I literally work Monday through Thursday, and then I'm off, and I wouldn't even say I'm literally off on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I really am never really off on Fridays. Lately, there's been a lot of events going on for my um boyfriend's family and stuff so it's been a lot of like graduation and like just a bunch of different stuff where i've been having to focus on like baking stuff so i've been doing like my um basically like my baking business stuff and i'm not gonna lie if i'm like anybody or anyone who does makeup i gotta be right in the mirror when i do my eyelid my eyebrow next thing i'm gonna do which I didn't do is moisturize my face. I didn't have a lot of moisturize my face and tripping. I always go in with some pines. But yeah, y'all, lately I have been, I have not been doing, I don't even say I haven't been doing a lot. I just had a lot going on. But I'm about to be very vulnerable with y'all, but your girl went and she lost her car, which was not fun at all, but it's okay because whatever God takes away, he always gonna bless tenfold with something else and I'm gonna work for it, period. So yeah, I ended up doing that and lose my car and that fucking sucked. So that's been a struggle. So been booking it to work and Ubering and stuff. And that shit is expensive. If you know, you know. Some girl gave this to me. Well, I bought it from her, from her like brand in Atlanta when I was like, working down there and she was selling it i stopped using it for a long time but i don't know why because this shit is golden it actually is really really good under your eyes but yeah that's a so that's what's been going on so i know i have um some girls from uh rich with rich girls rich off content that have messaged me that want to like collab and link and stuff and i haven't been able to do it because of my car situation i actually have to call one of them to let her know what's tea but um yeah that sucks but it's okay because like i said whatever god takes away he always gonna bless tenfold so i'm not pressed or stressed about it too too much i i don't know how to explain it but have you ever lost something and then you like i kind of feel relieved that's kind of how i felt i was like okay this this kind of relief because i was like Honestly, I was financing my car, y'all, and I'm about to be very transparent with y'all, but a bitch cannot afford that shit. It was too motherfucking expensive, and it was too much, and I'm like, um, yeah, no. And the way that the economy and everything has been going, it was way too much for me, so, yeah. And what where I'm at now, like, we paying rent is crazy on top of having to pay, like, what we pay. I'm not gonna tell y'all, but just know it was expensive. It was not cheap. Um, like having other bills and then this place don't even offer they don't uh, and i don't want to sound like i'm complaining or anything i'm just like venting about what has been going on in my life because i feel like i'm very comfortable with my youtube fam y'all deserve to know why i've been missing in action and at one point your girl was posting every day but like i said life be life and things be happening i lost my grandpa last year that fucking sucked because he basically um, helped 
my parents raised me and my brothers and my sister and um we lost him to diabetes and stuff and that was really sad and it sucked and i'm honestly just now being able to talk to it about it and we lost him last year in november so that was something that was going on that had happened too so i was like i need to break off of youtube because that was just really a sad like a really sad time for me and i yesterday i just checked in with a few of my friends because i'm like i haven't checked in with my friends in so long so i'm gonna try facetiming them today i know one of them she's a makeup artist so she probably was at an event but i'm like let me check in with my friends it's been a minute and i don't want to just ghost them and not let them know what's going on because we all need people in our corner so that was what was kind of going on and um i started working in an office i actually enjoy now which it's not bad it's monday through thursday of course there's little stuff always there's always going to be little stuff anywhere you go but it, um it's monday through thursday and i, I really like that schedule because for a long time i was working friday saturday and sundays and i literally had no time to do like the stuff I wanted to do, like for my businesses and stuff. But now I have the opportunity to do it, so it's time to get back on it, girl. Like, Beyonce says you get one day to feel bad for yourself, after that, it's back to the business. So, I went, <laughs> I gave myself a, a couple days to feel bad, but it's okay. Everybody has their own time and season, and I want to be mentally right, especially when I'm giving y'all content and stuff like that. I don't want it to just be half a. So, that's what I'm doing. So that's what's been going on. And then just routine. Let me tell y'all, getting into a routine and just making sure you on that routine. That is something. Cause I'm a girl that I strive off of a routine. Like I've tried to just wake up and wing it. And I do horrible when I do that. So I'm a girly that needs a routine because I strive off of routines. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just like, let me show y'all what I'm actually doing. But I'm like, I strive off routine, so why am I even going to play myself and not give myself a routine when I know that's something that I strive off of? So let's not even play with myself like that. This is the life of a blind girl. <laughs> I gotta literally put my glasses on to see. Like, that I'm doing okay. I feel like for me not having a mom, I'm doing pretty good. I'm breaking out a little bit, but that's because I haven't been on my skincare, which is another thing. Cause like, like I said, I mean, like I really been going through it y'all. Like, and I'm a real person. I have real problems. I got real stuff that I have going on behind the scenes. Like I know y'all see my hygiene content and my other content and stuff. You're like, oh my gosh, no, my life is not perfect. Your girl has real life issues. Like I said, like, I'm a real regular devil little person and I be having real stuff going on behind the scenes. And it's, I feel like with a lot of YouTubers and people like in that spotlight, they try to act or play like they don't got stuff going on, but it's like, baby, like you a human, we know you got stuff going on. You could tell us, it's all right. And I feel like too, some people just don't want to say nothing because they don't want to get bashed or clown, but it's like, life is life and everybody always gonna have something going on in their life and that's just the beauty of life like i was watching um the graves house yesterday or the day before i need to have more foundation this is not my color but we're not gonna talk about that but i was watching the graves house and they were talking about that and i was just like that's all tea like y'all right like life really does not just one straight shot everybody has something I'm really not supposed to be using this. I'm supposed to be using a beauty blender, but it's okay. But it's not just one straight shot. Everybody has stuff that they're like they go through, and trying to play like you don't is crazy to me. Ignore the back. Get that cut. So, yeah, I'm like that's just viable. But I deserve it to my OGs to tell y'all what's going on. I always been real with y'all and told y'all what was going on what I had going on always so I'm not gonna stop doing that now like yeah always been a transparent girly okay it's looking good I'm trying to figure out if I'm gonna add eyeshadow I might do green because I got on this young thug shirt and 
for my picture. I kind of want to grease slide, slide. But yeah, might do that. But it's not easy out here. Y'all be in a rush to grow up fast. Y'all just don't even know. I was gonna, I was gonna use this tart palette. Right. Cause I like the browns and it smells like chocolate. But I'm not gonna do that. Then I'm probably going with some Maybelline. Cause I like the Maybelline palette. But yeah, y'all. That was hard to open up about. And I was like, I don't even know if I really wanted to tell y'all. But I know there's people out there that's probably going through the same thing that we were going through. And that's not an easy situation. But I hope and pray that if you are, you get through it and you find a way or work it out or have people to help you in that. Because that's not, that that is not anything I will wish on anybody, y'all. Like, mm -mm. But... The color I'm going to be using is, I'm going to use lemonade craze, but I might use sugar coated. I'm going to use sugar coated. I feel like I'm making this video too long. Do y'all like when I do long videos or do y'all like I'm short? That's what I really want to know because I just be talking and I'm like, do y'all really be wanting to hear me talk or would y'all rather just know talking me just do my makeup? The real double C or Chanel. If y'all know her, y'all know she she used to be she was Chanel, then she went to double C, then she went to shade, shade, I think shade room is her her um thing now. Bro, I love that girl. That girl don't even know how much I love her content and like I don't even know her, but just the authenticity authenticity of her content and just being vulnerable on like the camera. And I know like you shouldn't always be like that, but like to be able to be that brave and do that and not give a F about what nobody got to say, I love that. And she's young, so I'm just like, girl, I salute you. Like, it's a couple other YouTubers I like watching too that I'm like, oh my gosh, y'all doing the thing. Like the mommy YouTuber community. McKenna Walker, Maya Prosser's Graves. Like, y'all really doing the damn thing. Like, I'm trying to tell y'all, like, it's not something easy. And if I'm cursing too much, y'all, I apologize. I gotta work on that with my mouth. That is something I'm working on. And the first step to fixing a problem is realizing it is a problem. So that's something I'm trying to work on and be better with. Well, I'm going to be better with. I'm not gonna say trying to. But we don't try over here, we do, period. Oh, and I forgot my girl, Kyla J. Hello. She She's a, a good freaking mom too, bro. Like, she really doing her thing. If y'all haven't, make sure that y'all go buy her book, her ebook, Girls Rich Off Content. I'm gonna link it in the description below, I'm tripping. But um, y'all better go check her out because her prices is going up. She's doing a one-on-one -on -one calls. Can't purchase right now, baby, but I could support and I could shout you out. That's what I could do right now. But I do plan on in the future doing that because let me tell y'all, that girl knows what she's doing. She has a whole page committed to showing how content creators can grow. Basically showing the girls everything behind the scenes. And she she on to something with that, y'all. Like, y'all sleeping on my girl, but just wait. Because she gonna, y'all just be sleeping. Y'all be weird. Y'all be wanting to hop on the little bandwagons and stuff when people be popping off and that just is like insane to me but i ain't gonna lie she she's another young one and she doing it like they really out here doing a damn thing and i love that for them like i love it i love it love it love it um just like Ooh, if there's one thing i'm gonna do it's gonna be beating my face baby all right what is that I was gonna say I could do better, but I feel like I did a damn good job. Mm -hmm. Hi, baby. You can't see me yet. You can't see me yet. Okay. There you. Go. <laughs> All right. So my boyfriend got here faster than I thought, but. He can't see me yet. He gonna have to wait just like everybody else. But I feel like this is cute. I did my dance. <laughs> I did my dance on TikTok and went viral with it. 
okay so i'm really like wow well, i'm really that girl because i did that but i gotta add the lashes now that's the last thing do i want to make